Alright, hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Uh, this is the episode 3 of the Pyromancer Lilith series, where today, unfortunately, when I recorded this video, I unfortunately forgot to turn on my microphone. So, I'm here uh, editing the video now, and I'm just going to um, reenact it as best I can. So, yeah. Starting off, uh, I decided to do one go at the uh, Golden Chi. I mean, <laughs> golden key chest. Um, usually, whenever people do these challenges, they say no golden chest. Uh, for this one, I just wanted to try it out. And then the first one I got was this. Uh, um, I first saw this bruiser, and then I saw this Tidior SMG. Fire! So hey, I can use it. When I first picked it up, I was like, you know what? No, I don't. I don't need it. The fire rate is too low. But then I, after some consideration, I actually said, you know what? Uh, max size is higher, it's a TDR, so faster reload and faster damage, I mean, and higher damage, uh, so it'll be perfect, so I decided to take it. And we're also going to be doing the, uh, the scavenger, uh, sniper rifle mission to hopefully get a, a fire sniper. Um, I don't really know what level they spawn in, I don't know if it's like, uh, blues or greens or all that stuff, but, uh, hopefully we can get a fire sniper when we do that. You know what? yeah, I don't need this panacea shield. Oh well, uh, this is actually the first playthrough that I've actually used different types of shields. You know, I've always just kind of didn't really care for any of the shields in this game because all uh, you would need is a panacea shield for healing, and or uh, if you're Roland, you don't even need it. You could just use a pangolin shield, but yeah. All right, so we're gonna skip racks. All right, so the easiest way to take on Mole Marley if you are under leveled or it's first time playing. Uh, so they spawn over there if you get the mission. So we're just going to aggro them by shooting at or near them, and then we're just going to. Oh, my phone rang. <laughs> uh, we're going to take them over to. Do, do, do. Let's go this way. All right, come on. All right, all right. There's no. All right, let's go. Both of them. Oh, do, do, do. Let's do racks. Uh, we gotta take him over here and... Nope, shield down. <laughs> we gotta take him over to this spot and I'm dead. Oh my jeez. See, that's what I was talking about. The distance or taunt animation. Uh, we wait for her to scream or do that. And then we shoot her in the throat. Hold. Let's go, come on, clicker. Oh, okay. Switch to... Uh, there we go. Uh, <laughs> I almost said Moby. <laughs> Marley down. Let's take care of this fool. Come on, do, do the thing, do the thing. Oh, oh, take it. Uh, Rack safe, hey, 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 hey. No! I'm gonna take that fantasy shield again. Why are you regen health? Okay, uh, do, 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 let's do. So Panacea Shield and uh, no, let's do Fire Resistance and then uh, uh where's that? Transfusion. Let's go with that. Never use it, but whatever. Right, come on, yeah, level up, mode down. I can say that better. Mode down. Ah, uh, here it is. So, oh okay, it's an SNS. SNS Fire uh, times one proc. It's an SNS. It's high mag. Whatever. Let's try this out. Uh, <laughs> damage is fine. The fire rate, though, for these weapons kind of stinks. Okay, so if you're doing the uh, the scavenger missions, as you can see on my little compass thing, there is a little money bag. If you don't have anything on the ground, uh, so over there I had something on the ground, it would show the money bag. But let's, uh, let's go over here so I can show you what I mean. So yeah, right there where that grenade is, it shows a little money bag. If you didn't have anything in the uh, area, uh, it would actually lead you to the piece. So there's that first one. So there's the site. Then uh, we'll go over here. Take care of these fools. The second one is up here. Right there. Stop. Barrel. And lastly, the site. And then we are done. Okay, so we're gonna farm the sniper because I'm very curious to see what kind of. Uh, well, mainly what kind of rarity of a sniper we get. If it's blue or purple, then awesome. Uh, let's let me see if I can turn it in without actually saving. Oh, I think I got it. Uh, so Moa Marley get the fire artifact, perfect. Uh, so now we have fire damage in our uh, blaster. Awesome. Okay, run number one and oh, whoa. Okay, a Malawan blue sniper. Uh, 
Nice! <laughs> to say the least, awesome. Any launcher, I'm actually going to use that for uh, uh, bringing me down instead of using grenades. Uh, I can't actually kill uh, things with it. Uh, here, actually, let's switch my grenade real quick. So I'm going to go over here, I'm going to exit the exit the area, come back, and we'll call it good. Uh, I can't actually kill enemies with this launcher, I can only kill myself, and then here once we get the, uh, we'll get something else, we can use that instead. Alright, now I'll run number two, and once again, a blue sniper. I wonder if you get blue snipers guaranteed. Oh no, I don't think I, s I did it right for that one. No, I did it wrong. Ah, that sucks. Oh well, we can't use it. Alright, we're going to go back to the Arid Hills, and we're actually going to take on, uh, what's his face? The, uh, the, the, the big dude, uh, the, uh, Roy, 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 oh my gosh, Royd Rage Psycho. There we go. Say it slowly, man. <laughs> Alright, we're going to take on the Royd Rage Psycho, and he drops a guaranteed launcher in the Remastered Edition. So hopefully, by the end of this episode, I can have a fire launcher, and if not, I'll farm off camera so I can get one. Alright, so we're actually going to do the Claptrap mission now. So you can actually get him through the fence wall thing here, so we're going to pick that up. Then we literally go over here, just a handful of feet away. We jump, and there we go, we got it. And then, bam, first storage deck upgrade. Uh, so now we have... 15 slots, that's well, perfect. Okay, time for the Roid Rage Psycho. Let's see here, so that's our skill tree to do, do. What are we going to use? Uh, let's get rid of the stuff that we don't need. Get rid of you, get rid of you. Uh, yeah, we're going to put on the Fire Nova. Um, I'm thinking about doing the Incendiary Grenade, or the Betty, sorry. Uh, and then... Yeah, we're just going to go with that. So we're, yeah, we're going to use a clipper if we need to. Uh, we don't need that dull assault rifle. And I would have liked to use the uh, the rain grenade, but we're not high enough level. That kind of sucks. Alright, let's go kill him. Let's throw these to compensate, and I did not compensate for that. Let's throw another one. Oh, what? Where'd I go? Did <laughs> that floor just ate my grenade. Yeah, let's run away. Run away. Crits. This is not a hard boss, pretty much at all. I mean, if you're not careful, uh, his grenade can down you. Uh, so you just gotta watch out for it. Now for these guys, my favorite thing to do is maul up in here. Let's get by. Oh, that wasn't a lot. Let's do this the Pure Nova. Here we go. Oh, it's so beautiful. Every time. I love it. And, uh, flat off non elemental launcher. That sucks. Alright, so kill number two, where is he? Let's go with these guys. Um, not, no, not the right one. Uh, we did get this Vladov Sniper though. Super high fire rate, but lower damage. I think this would be a lot better. Oh, it's a close kill. <laughs> oh well, it'll be fine. I saw you two making out over there. You can't, you can't hide from it. Okay, uh, let's skip them. No, oh, oh, no, I'm just gonna skip them. Okay, run number three. So, Betty, 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 and let's go for the snipe. Oh, I do like this fire rate. Switch with Quicksilver added on, that'd be nice. It, oh, what? I, uh, see, that's why you want to watch out, because this grenades, for some reason, can just really just knock you up if you're not careful. And there we go, level up, level 16. Oh, that's my favorite thing to do for the midgets. Okay, now we're going to go one point into intuition for now with movement speed, which will be useful. Uh, oh, Jacob Sniper, alright. Good day. Ah, uh, not the right one. Dang it. Alright guys, that's going to be the end of this episode. I do hope you guys enjoyed, and if you liked it, be sure to leave a like, and if you really liked it, be sure to sub. Hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you all in the next one. See ya!